The attachment data type can be used if you would like um, for an attachment to be inputted into the database. You do need to be careful if you have an attachment field that you don't put in attachments that are very large files because your database is already pretty big so if you're at all concerned about file size you don't want to have a lot of attachments linked to it as well. Um, you can attach just about anything you want, a picture, another file of some sort, and how you set this up is make sure that you're in design view. By the field name that you want to set as an attachment, click on data type and click attachment. You can choose to change the caption if you'd like and you can choose to make it a required field. We'll go back to design view or data sheet view and see what this looks like. Save our table. Scroll over and you can tell by the little paper clip that it is an attachment field. How you would actually attach a file in here is by double clicking it and then clicking on add and then you could go through and you could choose a file. I'll choose the backup file just for an example. Click open. Um, I can also highlight this and I can remove it. Um, I can open certain files from here. I can also save the attachments from here. Click on OK and you can see it tells me that I have one attachment in that field.